Hey everybody, Kathy at North Star Prep Stetter. Well, this is just kind of a really simple cooking video. I'm going to show you how I saute mushrooms. Now, um, when I was growing up, little until I was a teenager, I did not like mushrooms. I still don't care for them raw, but I love them sauteed. How I ended up finding out about sauteed mushrooms, because my mom never sauteed them. She was just like raw, put them in there. That's the way she liked them. So, um, but I went on a trip with them with my mom and dad and they served like this little boat dish of mushrooms that were sauteed and oh my gosh they smelled so good and I tasted it and fell in love right then so um so anyway I do kind of I don't know if I if anybody else uses the same seasonings that I do but I'm sharing that with you today so here I have a package of mushrooms and um, I know that they always say you know just dust them off just brush off the dirt and everything but for the purposes of the way I saute I don't mind having um, <laughs> not having the dirt no, I mind having the dirt on there but because I don't know where that dirt came from but I don't mind rinsing them underwater so I'm going to show you how I clean them and I use just kind of room temperature water and I've got this um, nice little netted cloth here and it kind of goes through and collects everything very easily. These mushrooms are not quite at prime, but so it cleans it off very nicely. So then I place them on paper towels to help absorb the extra drips and water that come off of there. So I'm going to go ahead and finish cleaning these. Now while I cut up my mushrooms, I'm going to let the um, butter start to um, melt in the pan here. So for this many mushrooms, I'm going to use about a half a stick of butter. And I'm just going to turn this on low and cover it at this point. Alright, I'm going to start slicing up these mushrooms. Now ones that are much bigger if I don't want great big slices for the, what I'm going to use these for, I may cut them in half first and then slice them down this way. Most of these will be used in omelets or um, garnishing my hamburger or whatever I have like that. So definitely a side dish or a nice add-on. already and melted and I'm going to add the mushrooms. Now I know they say don't crowd the mushrooms but this is a big pan. This is a 12 inch fry pan um, and these do just fine in here for how I cook them. All right just trying to get those all coated. And then I add garlic powder and Italian seasoning. These are the flavors that I enjoy and oh my goodness, it makes such great mushrooms. So I'm going to stir these up a little bit, coat them. I don't want to overpower it with the Italian seasoning, but enough to flavor everything. Turn it up to medium and cover it and we'll be back. Okay, things have been sauteing for a little bit. Ooh, look at all that moisture. The one thing is that mushrooms release a lot of moisture. So I'm just gonna stir these up. So some of their water mixed in with the, um, the butter. Kind of rearrange them again, flip them a little bit. And I'm going to turn the temperature down a little to like a medium low. Cover them back up again. It's important to keep them covered because that keeps the moisture in. All right, let's check on these again. Oh, 
so they're very well cooked through and they're just starting to um, you know a few of them are getting a little bit browned there and that's what I like uh, there's flavor in the brown so I'm gonna have them go just another minute or two and then I'm gonna turn the heat off and just spread these out a little bit so they're even and they can cook up evenly So here we go. Look at all this wonderful goodness here. Mm. See, I like them a little bit browned, a little more done. The flavor is immense when you do this. So there you go, a really easy, delicious way to make sauteed mushrooms. I hope you do that. Uh, you know what? Leave a comment below on how you prefer to have mushrooms done. If you just like them raw or if you have a specific way that you like to saute them. I would love to hear about it. So you guys take care. God bless. Always have hope. Bye.